Men's under freestyle S11. Three Ukrainians in the centre lane. Can they be challenged by Alexander Chekharov? Makovsky. First of the two Polish swimmers will go in the outside lane. Alexander Chekharov. 40 year old who won the 50 freestyle. Alexander Maschenko, one of the experienced Ukrainian swimmers, next to Viktor Smirnov. Can it be another major title for Smirnov? Next to them, Dmitry Zalewski, inspired by the two men next to him. He's now alongside them in the European Championship final. Marcin Ryska from Poland in the outside lane. This is again the S11 class, swimmers with no vision, they're wearing blacked out goggles. It's the 100 freestyle, the champion in the 50 freestyle. That was Alexander Chekharov in lane number three, expect him to go out fast. He's 40 years of age, but boy can he move. Standing. Very straight, Chekharov. They are away for the final of the 100 freestyle. Well, we love these S11 freestyle races. Completely blind swimmers, all of them. Good start, and every single man in this race is immediately headed to the lane rope so that they can find the straightest line down the lane pool. The tapper's going to come into effect here. So important to get the turn right. Mashenko leads. If his tapper can get this right, and he can get the wall well. He does, absolutely superb. I can't remember the last time I saw an S11 turn that good and it really pays off. He's a body length in front now. That was superb from Maschenko. Can he keep that straight line in the center? Just brushing that lane rope with his hand. He is moving slightly to the left. He's corsoded himself there. Still on the lane rope though. Maschenko is gonna bring this one home, surely. It's a great fight for Silva. Makovsky going well for Poland. But Chikarov coming through now. It's gold for Maschenko in 101.84. Chikarov the silver. And Makowski from Poland from the outside lane will take a surprise bronze for the Polish team. But it was good from Maschenko. He did a great turn. And despite brushing the lane ropes there on the second 50, he managed to correct himself and came away for a comfortable gold medal swim. Well, I think all of these swimmers still waiting to hear the results. Their tappers will be uh, telling them now what times they've done and where they've come. But it really was a great swim. Personal best, I think, for Mashenko. Mikowski delighted there. Here we go, there's the lane scorch. rope hit. As they come down the second length, it does well to only really hit it once, often these blind swimmers, they'll hit the lane rope, correct, and then overcorrect their correction and career back into the lane rope. But he does well, hits it once, and then just corrects just enough to get himself back on the straight line. Tapper hits the finish right. Here it comes. Very much a whip hit. <laughs> He's going to make sure he knows that it's coming. He's right over the side of that lane, isn't he? It's a good swim, Maschenko. Well, what will happen now to these uh, S11 swimmers, Paul? Well, look at the goggles checked. They've had these goggles checked now. They're going into the swim down pool. There, they will warm down. They'll have their medal presentation later. Maschenko on a 1.84. He takes the gold medal. Check her off in second.